uh, so quantitative analysis of electrolysis so uh, the first law of uh, the, the faraday's law so according to the first law of electrolysis the mass of substance oxidized or reduced at electrode is directly proportional to the charge utilized in the process throughout the solution so whenever we have a solution like uh, so in that uh, case the mass of substance oxidized or reduced at electrode that is directly proportional that is directly proportional to the charge utilized in the solution so uh, how, how much charge we have used that is directly proportional to it so w equal directly proportional to q and that q when we replace in the endings it and z is the proportionally null constant so q is uh, charge into time so z when q or i is then mass is z so z is whenever we write z uh, that means electrochemical equivalent so m is the mass of substance oxidized reduce of electrode i is the current in 1 ampere and t is the time and z is the uh, mass of substance oxidized or reduced when one column of charge is utilized in the process so let's take an example like we have a sodium so one faraday of 96500 faraday is oxidized utilized for one mole of sodium uh, so 1 by 96500 into m into n a gram so z equals to 23 by 96500 so that is the the mass of substance oxidized or reduced in the process so then magnesium plus two is a uh, plus two electron is a magnesium so two farad is one mole so one coulomb is 24 by 96500 multiply by two and uh, that is the molar mass into nf in multiply by 96500 that is equals to e by f so that is equivalent mass into farad into charge so that is z okay so uh, whenever we write sodium so that the molar mass we will be writing on the 96500 and uh, whenever molar mass is uh, divided by nf 96500 that is equivalent mass divided by charge in, uh, in the faraday okay so magnesium we have whatever the so whatever the material we are using and whatever the charge we are getting that, that both are being utilized okay so z is finally the molar mass divided by an n factor into 96500 and n factor is the change in oxidation state for the oxidation and reduction that's how we define the qualitative analysis of electrode